my name is Natalie, and today I'm going to talk to you about the movement of breath. So there is a common misconception that ideally only your belly moves when you breathe. And belly breathing has become synonymous with diaphragmatic breathing. But in reality, there's more movement that should be happening anytime that you breathe. So one third of movement does happen at your belly. But another third of movement also happens at the base of your rib cage, and another third of movement happens at your chest. This is because your diaphragm is the muscle responsible for inspiration, inhalation. Your diaphragm contracts and flattens down as you inhale. And you can see with this action that my elbows move side to side, and that's exactly what your rib cage does as well. Your rib cage expands with your diaphragm contracting, and this allows your lungs to expand and draw air in. So, a way that you can practice getting good rib cage excursion, good rib cage opening at home, is to grab a strap or a towel or um, a belt. You'll wrap it around the back side of you at the base of your ribs, and then cross it in front underneath what would be a bra line. And as you practice and continue to think about movement happening at both your belly and your chest, you can think about breathing into the sides of the strap and breathing right and left. So with your inhale, you'll go like this and exhale out. Inhale and exhale. What this strap offers me is tactile feedback for something to actually breathe into, and it also gives me visual feedback so I can look down and actually see the straps move. So go ahead, give this a try at home, and see if it helps you get more inhale, more air as you breathe.